Bhagavad Gita, text 2.20 The soul neither is born, nor does it ever die, nor being will it ever cease to be, unborn, eternal, not subject to decay, primeval, it is not slain when the body is slain. The soul can be neither the agent nor the object of the act of killing, for it is changeless. It does not undergo the sixfold transformations of birth, growth, maturation, mutation, decay and death. The logic of this verse is as follows. The soul is not born and does not die. This is so because the soul has never been non-existent, nor has it become existent at some point in time. Therefore, the soul is eternal. This idea that the soul does not undergo transformation is indicated by the words Puranaha and Shashvataha. Because the soul exists forever, Shashvataha, it never decays, and because it is primeval, Puranaha, it has not grown into a new state, nor has it matured or mutated. Having advanced his proposition, Krishna next seeks to prove it.